they judged you wrong and it messed up their life. They are believing a false narrative about you. Somebody told them something, they believed it, and now it's messing up their life. It's also messing up the life of the person who lied about you. They are believing lies about you and it's messing them up. My goodness, they are so convinced that you're up to no good. They are so convinced that you are something that you are not. And they really believe it. They are saying it to people. They are telling everybody about it. They are so convinced and they are dead wrong. If it were not about you, you may have believed it. That is how convinced these people are. But like I said, they are only messing up their life because of the way they look at you. And sometimes it could be a case of two people are in a relationship. One person in that relationship told a lie to their partner about you. And now their relationship is screwed up. They didn't take time to find out who you really are, the light that you are, the advancing man or advancing woman that you are, the chosen one that you are, the blessed one, the anointed one, the appointed one, the great person that you are. They didn't take time. They just judged you. They just went with a false narrative about you. How unfair, it's crazy. And on one hand, it's laughable because you know that what they are saying about you is untrue. It's all fabricated, all made up. My goodness, how can people fool themselves like this? fooling themselves. We must be careful because it can be many people, in fact, believe things that are untrue. Let's say they are in a relationship. They believe their partner is doing them wrong. They believe, let's say you are cheating on them. You are not. And now they are destroying the entire relationship because of a lie that they believe. Yeah, they, they are believing a lie about you and it is screwing up their life. They are seeing you as if you are the enemy. You're not. You're not against them. They are acting as if you are the enemy. Meanwhile, somebody else is the enemy. They shouldn't fear you. They shouldn't be afraid of you. They should be afraid of somebody else. Hmm? If they want to be afraid, not you. You are no threat to them. You will not hurt them in any way. You will not do them any harm. You are not against them. Meanwhile, there are people who are against them and they cannot see it. They are so focused on you and trying to destroy you, trying to bring you down when you haven't done anything to them. You are not guilty of anything. They are the ones who made up their story. They are the ones who made up their lie and they are believing it about you. Meanwhile, you are fine. You are an observer. You realize what is happening. 
you find it crazy, ridiculous, it is not affecting you, it is affecting them. It's affecting them. And they are talking about you to others, trying to bring you down, telling people that you are something you're not, and it's all negative. They feel threatened by you. You are somebody who is advancing, who is rising. You are a go-getter. You are moving on up to the top, like the song says, the Jeffersons. You are that type of person who has that advancing mindset. And because of that advancing mindset, you end up taking inspired action. You put in the work. You put in the work that is required. You are a hard-working man or woman. And if anybody is watching me and they are not a hard-working man or woman, hey, get on board. <laughs> As an advancing man or advancing woman, you have to be prepared to push in the work. Not just hard work, but smart work as well. Hmm? Because you know what you want. You are focused on your goals. You are focused on moving forward. Hmm? Let me bring down the window a little. It's getting a little hot in here. <laughs> you are focused on moving forward. On climbing. And you may not have, a, you may not have everything you want as yet. But you know that you are manifesting your heart's desires. So they are looking at you and they are so jealous. They are looking at your growth and they are so envious. They are looking at your life and they are so jealous, so envious. They want to be you. So they hate you. They hate you for no good reason there's something great about you there is something amazing about you and that is why they hate you so much they know how great you are how powerful you are how amazing you are how blessed you are and there they are judging you wrong there they are, believing a lie about you. They never asked you a question. We were talking about people, you know, somebody you know, they never asked you a question. Is this true or untrue? And they just accepted the lie as truth. They accepted the lie about you as truth. It's not affecting you. You won't allow it to affect you. As much as you do not like what is going on, you won't allow it to affect you. Let it affect them. They are the ones who made up their thing. It's affecting them. If they were smart, they would have approached you had a conversation with you, everything would have been cleared up and they would have lived happily ever after. <laughs> they would have lived happily ever after as you smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. But no, they want to keep hurting themselves. They want to keep believing a lie. When, like I said, you are not the enemy, you are not against them. Meanwhile, people are trying to bring them down, they cannot see it. People are trying to take something away from them, they cannot see it. You are not trying to take anything away from these people, you are too blessed. You already have what you have. You already have your gifts. 
you already you have already received what you have to receive there is more in store for you but you are already on this winning path you don't want anything that these people have you are not a threat to them in any way like we have seen yet still they are so intimidated by you so intimidated by you just because you're moving forward just because you are making progress have you seen this have you seen this in your life where somebody sees you as a threat somebody is judging you wrong somebody thinks you're gonna take something away from them it could be a relationship somebody thinks you want their man somebody thinks you want their woman their boyfriend their girlfriend their husband their wife somebody told the lie about you and they're believing it hmm? now it's affecting them now they cannot think straight now they have heartbreak they are judging you wrong for something you never did they are afraid of you they are looking at you so afraid and all you have to give is love you don't want any war with anybody you are all about love you're not a threat to them you're not a threat to anybody in that way you are all about positive vibes you are all about positive energy you're not about hurting others you believe in doing unto others as you would like others to do unto you they don't know you they have no clue who they are dealing with if they would have only taken the time to find out who you are they would have been fine but they prefer to jump to conclusion they prefer to judge they don't even know you they have no clue who you are and a lot of the time people are just projecting they are the ones with the problem and they think you are just like them it is said that every thief thinks others are thieves they look at everybody as a thief a thief <laughs> because they are a thief hmm? they are projecting every cheater sees other people as cheaters very often you are in a relationship people they are in a relationship and they think their partner is cheating on them why because that is the way they live their life because they are a cheater they are paying the price it's backfiring on them they are operating that way and they have to carry the burden the burden of thinking that other people are operating the same way they operate it affects them negatively so these people are there they cannot be happy they cannot find joy they cannot find peace because of the way they think because of the way they think about you because they hate you so much they are so against you you are on their mind morning noon and night they are thinking about you they are so obsessed with you and you have done nothing to them you are not against them in any way there they are carrying that heavy burden it's crazy 
carrying a heavy burden as if you did something to them. You did nothing to them. You are not against them in any way. Somebody came to them and told the lie about you. And very often that person who told the lie has to face the consequences. You see, we always talk about doing good. When you do good, good comes back to you. When you hurt others, you end up being hurt. When you attack others, you end up being attacked. Hmm? So they are the ones doing it to themselves. They are the ones doing it to themselves. It backfires on them as we're here. I'm here just chilling in the Audi Q5 and I'm sending you all of this good energy, all of these good vibes. Has anybody seen this in their life? Do, do anybody understand what I am talking about? Does anybody get where I am coming from? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments if you, if you have seen this in your life. Somebody is judging you wrong. Somebody is telling lies about you. Somebody is believing a lie about you. Now they're going crazy. Now they're losing their mind, thinking you're such a bad person. It's affecting them. And I heard somebody say, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. I heard somebody say that. Hmm? Continue to live your life in a God-blessed way. Continue, be, continue to be the blessed person that you are. I'll start the engine for a while. It's getting a, a little noisy outside. <laughs> continue to be the blessed person that you are. Continue to move forward. Continue to advance. Hmm? And don't worry about them. Like this artist says, why worry about them when you can pray them off? How about praying them off? They and all of their negativity. They and all of their darkness. They are against you. They want to bring you down. They want to destroy you. But they don't realize that when they try to destroy you, inadvertently, they are really and truly destroying themselves. It works against them, not you. You won't allow these things to work against you. If you start to feel bad, if you start to feel sad, you'll pick yourself up, you will dust yourself up, up. You will remind yourself of your greatness. You will remind yourself of how blessed you are, of how amazing you are, the advancing king or the advancing queen that you are, the royal one that you are. Just because they believe that about you doesn't mean that you believe it about yourself. You know they are wrong. They are dead wrong. They are judging you wrong. And now, since they are judging you wrong they can be happy <laughs> they can't find happiness they can't find joy they cannot find peace so what's the point hmm? as we're here thank you so much for watching the video thank you for liking thank you for commenting thank you for being here with me those of you who watch video after video big up To those of you who are subscribers, and even more than that, those of you who are members of this channel, this advancing channel, every advancing luminary, every advancing visionary. My name is Manchus. As you already know, this is the advancing channel. One love, God bless, and all the best. <laughs>